Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's that's kind of what I hear every year. Every team I play with, I'm you know. I think you can lead in different ways. I'm not the type of guy who screams in front of the team and stuff like that, but uh, I try to be an example on the court, off the court, and and kind of stay level-headed and you know and have that be something that the guys look to. I think that's a good quality to have. To anything, I, I like the guys to look at me and be able to you know feel that sense of calm and uh, you know I just think in, in anything it's good to be level-headed and uh, you know have that be that example. Yeah, um, yeah, we're doing uh, a lot better on the ball. Um, you know, we needed to pressure more on the ball, and then Jack's doing an unbelievable job since since Turkey. Um, you know, really uh, putting in good effort, and uh, you know, being able to stop the ball and stay back on his man, and uh, that's 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 been the key. Right. Yeah. You know, that's my weapon, you know, brain before physically anyway. So that, that's a good thing for me that I, I don't rely only on my physical because it's been a rough month for me uh, physically. You know, I've been having problems with my knee. For me to have a good game, it's more thinking and, and, and using my brain for the team and putting people in good positions to help us win. Yeah, I think it's the key too. That that was the game that kind of changed everything. But uh, I mean, we didn't take any different approach. It was just it was something that I think with all things that when you continue to work and keep a good attitude, things will will kind of fall in in your favor after a while. So you know, I just think we we just stuck together as a team, and you know that win gave us confidence to and good momentum to to put us on this run that we're on now. For me, I, th I think if we can get four, we, I think we can be okay. I think and that's realistic, and I think we can do it. I think if we get four, we should be okay. For me, Bologna. I know we beat them twice, but I, I really like their team. Uh, I think we match up well against them, but I think they give problems for a lot of the other teams in this six to eight, you know, position. So, um, you know, I think Bologna's tough for who we have to play um, next. Uh, Trieste at home is gonna be really, really difficult. Obviously, Milan on the road. Yeah, that'll be crazy. That'll be crazy. Uh, a lot of the fans from Cantu have been writing me about that. Like, hey, we, it may be the last game decides who goes. And, but hopefully we uh, put ourselves in a position that, you know, maybe, by the fifth game, we know we're in the playoffs. You know, that's that's the idea. Well, as far as team, uh, I'd say Venice. I like the way they play. They, they're really difficult. They're, you know, even last year, uh, they were a tough matchup for us. And uh, I just like the way they play. They, you know, as far as a player, I've been really impressed with a uh, punter from uh, Bologna. He's he's an unbelievable scorer, and uh, I've been really impressed with him. Yeah, uh, for sure, both, both. I'd, if I had to choose one, I don't know. Personally, I don't want to miss the playoffs in, in the Italian league. For me, as a personal goal, when I came here, I said I wanted, you know, after last season when the team didn't make the um, Italian Cup and the playoffs, that was two of my main goals coming here was let's help get this team to the Italian Cup, which we did, got to the semifinals and in uh, the playoffs. So for me, that's that's really important.